When you go into a community right now where work has not happened, you find that women and children are walking long distances. They're walking to water sources that are dirty and contaminated. So a 20 liter jerry can weighs more than 40 pounds. So if you can imagine carrying 40 pounds of dirty water so that your family can have some water, then that water is making their children sick. So you combine all of these things and you find families and communities that are not as productive as they could be. You find children who are missing school because they're sick or because they're gathering water. When we go into an area, we don't do water alone. We do water, sanitation, hygiene. When you take these things together, we call it a WASH program. This begins with behavior change transformation. So we're working with sanitation and hygiene and water at the beginning and helping a community to understand how these things are linked to their health. After a while, we then begin to work on building latrines with the community. I have tip it up, I have latrine. If I go in the toilet for defecate, I came out and wash my hand with soap. After that point in time, we identify the locations where clean water is still needed. One of the interesting things with drilling is that it takes dirty water to make clean water. So as the drillers are gathered around the drill, they're doing their work and the community is doing the work behind them that makes that possible. And then later on what you begin to see is you see this dirty water come out of the well as they develop the well and the water becomes clean. At Life Water, we believe that the spiritual and the physical are absolutely interconnected. We believe that Jesus came to minister to people's hearts and also to their bodies. And some of the testimonies we hear back are absolutely phenomenal. I remember one woman telling me that for the first time, she understood that God cared about her because God cared about who she was and how she was taking care of her family. The gospel became practical. We believe. If you're drinking good water, we should not only be concerned about your, your, your physical life, we should also be concerned about your spiritual life. My life is changes. If I compare the year back, we need to prepare our water very clean. We don't want any disease to come upon with us.